And what is up my fellow gamers? You are watching The Vengeful One Gaming, and I am your host, The Vengeful One. So this is Assassin's Creed Odyssey, Episode 3. In the last episode, we freed Phoebe, we talked to Marcus, and we got some quests now. The quest we're currently on, we have to take down this guy, this mercenary, Talos the Stone Fist. And I'm like 100% sure that this guy's name is a reference to the god of in Skyrim. The god in Skyrim, not the god of Skyrim. But Talos, the god in Skyrim. Who many Skyrim NPCs don't consider to be a god. Oblivion begs to differ, but not in Skyrim. <laughs> I should take a look. Okay, so I'm kind of starting to see where um, hard mode, or no, not hard mode, nightmare mode. We're still on nightmare mode. I'm starting to see how. Yeah. Uh, starting to see how nightmare mode's kind of affecting you know the grand scheme of things I forgot to start my timer so yeah I still use a timer to record how long each video is to know when to stop it I do that for technical reasons but we haven't really gotten too much into it so there's time But I'm starting to see how exactly the nightmare mode is affecting the gameplay because those enemies we're not supposed to be there. And also, they are Better really hard either. to kill. So now we go back into this and we mark him again. Let's just knock off this exclamation mark thing right here. Let's see, he's level 5, I'm still level 1. Hey, where did I die? I died like right around here, I think. No, I didn't. I don't. I don't really remember where I died last time. But we're gonna go try and assassinate this guy, Talos Stonefist, who is currently four levels above our level, and it's it's dangerous to try and take on a guy like that in my experience playing this game and particularly just for this game anybody that's like level 4 or level 5 higher than you is very very hard to beat I'm pretty sure, like, if they get at least six levels above you, the icon above their heads turns from a red level to a skull. And then after, and then if it does, it's impossible to beat that particular enemy. Sometimes. Wait, no. Yeah, impossible. should try and level up first or just lower the difficulty but nah I'm gonna try and try and kill him first oh no please don't tell me they're level 5 where are they? Sounds like they're at the top of the hill. Oh, yep, they're there. Oh, yeah, 
have the yeah, it is a level five. Oh, there's two of them. That's fantastic. That was that was a okay. Now there's water. If there was not water there, that would have been a horrible idea because I take a lot of fall damage. Okay, that's just like wall run kind of all the way over here. Just gonna get out of conflict so I can heal again. I don't really think this is gonna be too hard if we can sneak around him. Okay, forget that, he sees us. This will not end well. I should have just let him pass me. Yes, I am a coward. I am indeed a coward. I hardly do any damage. Okay. But that's not my problem. I'm either gonna level up or I'm gonna lower the difficulty because nightmare mode is exactly that. A nightmare. The wolves, one of the lowest not level, but lowest tier enemies in the game can two shot me. And that is not good. If I kept playing like that, if I kept trying to kill Talos the Stone Fist at level one, I'd essentially be playing Dark Souls because every second I would have to roll out of the way of his attacks just to live. And I'm not gonna do that, so I'm gonna quit this quest, I'm gonna do something else. I'm gonna do the debt collector, cause that's a very easy quest. There'll be trouble if I'm spotted here. I don't need to call Phobos, it's not that far. I should probably like, wait until I've done the rest of these quests until I take on the mercenary cuz I mean if I do more of the main quests and then I do that one cuz they're all kind of main quests they just branch out but if I do more main quests and level up then it'll be easier Obviously, I like to explore everywhere before I continue in a certain area. But obviously, I'm not gonna do that. Not on camera. I'll do it later. Sammy, Duris will be at the shop. Marcos to come down here himself if he wants his money. Huh? Uh, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marcos says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. You should have thought of that when you borrowed Drachmi, Duris. But my family. It's hot. I'm in a bad mood. And you're going to pay. We both know it. The question is. What do I break first? You or your merchandise? 
You told Marcos I've paid enough already. I won't bow to... to... to a mercenary or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Look, I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. Malaga. Still, that doesn't change the drag me you owe. Face it. Once the Cyclops gets hold of you, you'll both be dead. Alexios, good to see you. You know what? Every time I do this, I always decide to break his merchandise. But that's... that's no way to solve this dilemma. If I break his merchandise, he won't have anything to sell and he can't make money. So, I'm just gonna beat him senseless. Okay. Hey, stop! I That's my stuff! Alright, alright. I'll pay you, just stop! Oh shit, villagers. I hate the villagers. Fine. The man is yours. Just leave. Pleasure doing business with you, Doris. Keep my name off your lips. I don't want the Cyclops coming after me for the debt you can't pay. Okay. It looks like the villagers. No, it looks like that cutscene stopped them from attacking me any further. Let's re equip my sword. My very terrible, does barely any damage sword. But there's just one thing I need to do before I go back and see Marcos. Let's see if I can sell stuff. I can sell this. Ooh, I don't have enough money for that. I have the the right level, but I don't have enough money. What about this one? Yeah, that'll work. I do want the belt though, and I'm, I almost have enough money to get that, but... Yo, they have a unicorn! My sister would love that skin. I'm gonna buy these. Good day to you! There's a pack that I really want to get. It's, uh... So something like Hades or something, but it's got the it's got a spear, it's got a mount, and the armor set. And it's just a really really badass, cool armor set, and spear and stuff. It's all like on fire and it's like obsidian black. It's really neat, but I can't afford it. It's really expensive. You use heat. Helix credits to get You're it. running out of time until I the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he docks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. You can't hide behind your glorious Mistios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the drachmi. Good. Or I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Alexios. I can tell from the smile on your face, Doris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back, can't we? I'm sure it's possible. I'm... I'm pretty optimistic. We have no other choice now. We need a plan. That's what I do best. This'll take more than the usual tricks up your sleeve. <sighs> I long for the old days. Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Yo, 
this plot gets pretty deep. Don't see fishes like you every day, huh? <laughs> oh. Ha. You hungry? How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Huh? Think about it. Wait! Polonia. <laughs> Some gift. You were nothing without Marcos. And look how far we've come. From an orphan on the streets to a misthios with a havel. Another Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. And look at you. How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Skulking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakes stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can't. Why, I was just filling my friend Alexios in on the details. He already has a plan to deal with these bandits. You know me. Always prepared. What did I tell you? He will leave no stone unturned. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits. Today. A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Alexios, I've cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. If you want your wood, you'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. These balls will make me rich as Chrysos. They're that good, are they? War's brewing. The Athenians need good bows if they want to hold off the Spartans. Everybody benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marcos? You should be tired of this small-time shit. You'd make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you're a secret Spartan. That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonian. Yeah, the war she was talking about is the Peloponnesian War. It's the war against the Spartans and the Athenians. Right after the Spartans beat over. the Persians. There you my go, history. good as new. That bow is as strong as Heracles himself. Give it a try. Shoot your arrow at those dummies. Okay, let's see, we got 37 arrows. An ability point. You know, I'm, I'm just gonna put my ability points in now, just because, uh, you know, it's nightmare mode. I'm gonna need all the, I'm gonna need all the abilities I can get, all the help I can get. Shadow assassin. Acquire 
Rush level 5. Okay. Spread shot. Does that take more arrows? Yeah, because it fires three at once, so it would require more arrows. I'm just going to take this ability. Alright, we accepted multiple quests. Let's go do one. I'm pretty sure we have enough time to knock one quest out of the way. We also have the improved hunter bow. Really wish I had a helmet. See an eye for an eye. And let's do this one. So where is this lady at? Right here. Sometimes it's kinda hard to see the where the quest marker is. Because it kinda looks like the the scenery of the island. Fair is fair. Are you going to get my wood? Those fucking bandits need a thrashing. Fair is fair. I'll fix your wood problem. Finally! Marco sure is lucky he's got you as his scapegoat. Any idea where these bandits are? I'm not a tracker, I'm a boyer. They're in the mountains somewhere, that much I know. I'd check close to the lumber camps. There's plenty of trees around. Why do you need this type of wood? I've been working on a new type of bow. It's more flexible, so it lasts longer and can fire at greater range. Only a very special kind of wood that grows high in the mountains will do. I'll take care of the bandits. Make sure that you do, and be quick about it. I'll deal with these bandits, and get you the wood you need as fast as I can. Have patience. It won't take long. Ha! <laughs> if you knew how long Marcos has been feeding me excuses, you wouldn't be saying that. Alright, I did something for you, now you do something for me. Get my wood! Alright, let's go get this lady her wood. Morning wood! Ignore that. It just sucks though how you can't use shields in this game like in Origins. I really enjoy using shields. They're very helpful. Dude, I can't wait for Valhalla to come out. This is going to be a seriously awesome game. I've seen some YouTube videos about what it would be like. They've they've got information Here's from where the, the ambush game happened. developers. I should look around. That's gonna be just awesome. It's gonna incorporate all the best mechanics of every Assassin's Creed game. West. Wait a minute, which way is west? South, east. Is that north? Yeah, that's north. West. Wait a minute, hold on. Nope, not it. Oh, no. He keeps tracking me just, like, everywhere that I go. It's annoying. And also, like, how? How could you possibly know where I am? Oh, wait, hold on. The cart was emptied, then left behind. The thief can't have gotten far with that much cargo. Ah, 
caught in the back while fleeing. Must be the work of bandits. Okay. So we know where the bandits are now. They are. That must be the bandit camp right I'm looking over for. There. You know what? Nope. We're not gonna go for that yet. Not yet. How much gold do we have? Because we could probably. If we have enough. Nope. We have. 40. It's not enough to go buy new shit. Great. Just what I needed. Okay, so the level two is. Oh, 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 why? Oh, okay. This is definitely a nightmare. There we go. I barely do any damage. And even the level two wolves kill me really quickly. Oh no. Man, it usually doesn't take this much effort to kill them. I need to sneak up on them. Okay, I thought that that's probably just the wolf pelt. I thought that was an actual wolf. Let's not do that. It's not a good idea. I don't want to just fight everybody just straight up. I want to assassinate them. I was going to pick them off one by one. You know, get the ones that are alone first and then work my way towards the bigger crowds. But nope, they saw me. Not gonna go down the way I wanted it to. Oh, and they have a dog now. Well, that's not good. I really don't want to kill the dog. 
Why do you make me do such things? Okay, that was really gruesome. They don't even give you good loot anymore. Guess I'm not high enough level to get, like, really good loot. Oh, come on, I thought you were turning around. See that, uh, that time slow down thing that's not a perk that was just like when you die really really well that old bag won't just take my word for it okay let's see there's two treasure chests where's the where's the second one it's over here by the docks isn't it yeah You know, at this level, I don't think you find very much, like, armor and weapons. I think it's a very low, uh, drop at this level. Okay, except for those gloves. Check out those gloves. Check out uh, the loot that I get. I have 79 gold now. I have level 2 mercenary gloves. Let's equip those. Now I have Kefalonian lumber. Alright. If you just heard a big noise, I'm sorry about that. I I just hit my mic. After I uh, talk to Drusilla, after I get this quest done, I'm gonna end the video and start part four. Wait, is that the mercenary? Why does he have a, a level right there? He's just a simple farmer. Uh, I must have marked him at some point. He must have been one of the guys who tried to attack me before the one of those cutscenes. It's Marcus's mighty champion. <laughs> Don't tell me you actually did what I asked. I tracked the bandits and sent them to Addis. Your wood should arrive in town soon. And you expect me to believe the word of a mercenary? You really should have more faith in people. I said I'd get it done. And I did. I brought you some wood back to work with until the rest arrives. By the gods! You sure you work with Marcos? He's never once delivered on a promise. Incredible. I might work with him, but we're nothing alike. I'm true to my word. Then take your pay. Give none to Marcos. Alright, 130 gold. Now we can probably buy some more armor. Alright guys, I'm gonna end the video right here. And just remember to 
go on my channel, I have entire playlists dedicated to games that I play, two of which are this one, my Assassin's Creed Odyssey playthrough, which will get more content shortly, and my Assassin's Creed Origin playthrough, and then just some other random playlists with some games. It's not They're not playthroughs, it's just I like to have my channel organized like that. So like and subscribe and I'll send a link to the playlist of Assassin's Creed Odyssey so you can check out more of that content. So I will see you guys later. Till the next video, uh, part four.